All right. Why are you crackling, audio? Hold on just a second here while I figure this one out. Oh, I know why. Because I'm a dork. How's that? Okay, microphone's working now, too. What the... I really... <sighs> the struggles of a cheap, cheap streaming PC. Hello, everybody. We're gonna play some Subnautica Good Night. Uh, first things first, so... Nope, that's not what I want. I build a jukebox. The jukebox lets you listen to music in your base. No one said survival couldn't be funky. What is the purpose of this device? It plays music so that I have something to listen to. What is music? I can detect certain patterns in it. We gotta turn the music down just a touch. Oh, it's actually spatial. Wow, okay. A sensor has an impact on your pulse and breathing. It makes you move. We make music, and we're moved by it. Not everything is about control, Alan. That's so weird. Okay. Can I turn the volume? Oh, I can even turn the volume down. Oh, interesting. Okay. So, my itinerary for today is going to be to finish exploring the wreck that we found. Um, I need to find spiral plant clippings. Uh, I need to find... And then there are two alien artifacts that I have been notified about that I'm going to try and figure out. Alright, so we got something there. Okay, and then we're gonna stick uh, the battery. All right, so it can charge while I'm out doing things. Hmm. Now the real question, take the prawn or do I take the sea truck? I mean, I think I take the sea truck for now, or the the prawn rather. And we're gonna go see if we can locate this data box that it says exists that I have missed.
could have sworn I was over here and got this, but apparently not. Titanium. Yep. I was definitely in here. I, I remember being in here. Is it that? Huh, okay, well. That's strange. Okay. So that's done. Might as well click the... Fragments while I'm here. Lithium. Sure. I need lithium. So... Why, hello there, Gaia. Good evening. Enjoy your lurk. Enjoy your cleaning, I guess? Somewhere there's going to be an access panel that I should be able to cut my way into. So. Because we saw that there was still a tunnel. Ah, oh, you're really not going to let me take that in there, are you? Okay, fine. Fine game. Fine, be that way. That's what we're trying to find, is that entrance. Well, that's weird. Don't do that, please.
me fill on oxygen quick and then I'm gonna see. I don't think I can squeeze there anyway, in fact. I'm pretty sure I can. So how does it fit in? That's a nuclear fuel rod. Interesting. Okay. Well. I was not expecting to find one of those already. How to get into that one room? I mean, obviously, there's a way. I can see the vent. Pretty well convinced it's got something cool in there. So. Oh, no, they're way to... Spinal fish. It's like spinal tap, except not not as good. There's or two. Ta-da! Here we are. Found it. Ooh, titanium. I'll take that. PDA. Am 
Well, the PDA might be worth it. Should have listened a sec. All right, I do, I do believe that this wreck is done. So we're saving. Ah, uh, it's a salvage. Back to base quick, drop the hall off, and then okay, I'm gonna pick up some away. Uh, let's see what we got going on. Here, oh. Logs and communications. I finished the reactor checks. We dumped a ton of runoff, and we don't need the rods melting down. Then, I helped with the scavenging, chopped some veggies with the cooks, and tried to help Diana, but she sent me down to engineering with Stephanos. I've been working with him the last few days. Stephanos... How to describe Stephanos? He's by far the most thorough engineer I've worked with. And no ego. He never leaves a job undone, no matter how late it is. I've never seen him awake before 11, and he always greets me by saying, Kalimera, Yasmin, in the sleepiest drawl. Not a morning person, that one. <laughs> he listens with the slightest smile on his face and twirls this stray curl by his ear. He asks a billion questions, but I don't mind. He surprised me today. There's an empty room on the bridge, just a spot of negative space in the ship. He set the picnic there and said, I need to relax. He even called me a busybody. There were these crazy glowing fungus things he found to set the ambiance. The most exciting part though, drum roll, he can jailbreak fabricators. He made a small batch of traditional Grecian dishes. But the craziest part, he managed to make a suitable falafel for me. I never thought I'd see a good falafel in deep space. Alhamdulillah. A quiet genius, that one. This planet may be a cold mistress, but hmm, maybe it isn't so bad. Well, that was cool. Dude decided to use his evil genius skills for good. And ended up having a cute little date out of it. That's... It's really cute. We're back for... Ah! I fell into the water. No! Alright, we're back for the lithium. One sec. I have slightly changed my base layout a little bit since yesterday.
And I don't even have a reactor yet. <laughs> I don't have a nuclear reactor. I don't know what I'm supposed to do with the rod yet. Titanium and copper, that seems appropriate. Let me put it on the wall there. Just extends the range of it. Oh, that's cute. Y'all need to not judge me, but I'm about to put some speakers up in this place. Wait, well, hey there, Jam. How are you doing tonight? I guess it's not tonight. I'm so used to saying tonight. How are you doing this evening? Woke up from a nap. Yeah. Naps are so... Naps are one of those things that when you're young, you... you don't appreciate nearly as much as when you do you're getting towards middle age oh thanks yeah it was time uh my bird my my bird my beard curls on one side and not the other and uh i was starting to look really homeless so figured it was time has been the biggest hold up so far in the game um I found that pretty quick actually biggest hold up for me so far I found diamond really quick actually um I I I knew that you had got diamond blocked and I was fully expecting to get diamond blocked um Mag I still don't know where magnetite's at. I, I don't have a. I'm have. I. The only magnetite I have found in the game has been brought to me by sea monkeys. Um. Yeah. That's that's it. That's probably where I'm at right now. Uh, I need to build the the depth module, the first depth module for the prawn. Now check off wreckage. I just I just got done exploring a big chunk of wreckage, and I need to find spi spiral plant clipping. I have two alien artifacts to explore. Yeah. So I'm not I'm not out of things to do, which is nice. Like this game is I feel much better about like giving you things to do rather than just relying on you being like having to explore until you find the thing that is kind of blocking you. 
Do I go for the high road or do I go for the lowest? Ah, let's go for the low. Save. Right. Mr. Fister, indeed. Alright, uh, we also need to... I'm gonna change the color of this wreckage beacon to do... going over here. I ran into my first reaper. I guess it's not a reaper. I don't know what it is. It tried to eat me. Um, I don't have the grappling hook yet. I just have the uh, just have the drill arm. I I went in the wrong way into uh, Phi Station. Um, I, I found a back way through the heat vents and used that to find the entrance and then I came back through the entrance which was kind of interesting Also found the crazy lady that's living on her own out here and it's like yeah the planet definitely ate one too many burritos lithium I seem to like I, I just discovered that lithium is just abundant over here but until then um, I was running low on lithium, like I couldn't to keep it in in stock as it were. She really is, man. I hope I hope that by the end of it you get the ability to make her uh, her modified prawn, because that thing is really cool. I was not expecting that thing to be here. Um, I need to repair. Fuck, I'm screwed. There a uh, hidey hole? Oh god, I did not want to. Shit. Uh. Yeah. I'm hoping he won't follow me here. Okay. Oof. There are so many nice little uh, quality of life changes that have been added to this for the console version. I am so happy with how things are uh, are made better on the console. The toggle run instead of the uh, the, the hold the left stick button to run is all right. Well, well, whatever this is, we can scan this one. <gasps> Sleeper module? Well, I was kind of hoping for a storage module, but that's okay. I'll take a sleeper module. Booster tank? New blueprint synthesized. Yeah, I, uh, I, I decided to use it. It just makes it a little easier to spot things. All right, we're gonna, we're gonna try and sneak around here. That's saved. Yep, yep, yep. Save is uh, it's now a, it's now a point redemption. I got rid of the, I got rid of the commands for those and, and just made them 
cheapo point redemptions. But yes, thank you. Where are you? Where are you? Here are you. Come here. Got a fist for you. I don't even know what these things are called. Like, I assume they're a uh, leviathan. But... I'm assuming I have to go down and under to get to this. Come here, Lip come here, lithium. Alright, I'll take it. I'm not gonna turn down a free med kit. I haven't I don't think I have the thing that oh, a battery. This game is like throwing batteries at me. something useful. I have collected enough data to extrapolate the location of a component necessary to assemble my body. I will provide a signal. Signal location uploaded to PDA. Walk out this way? Really? Leviathan, I don't don't want to fight you. This is the I also uh, I constructed a bioreactor. This is the I did not ever use one of those in the original. Alien artifact. That's the one I just explored, right? So. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, that's the... Okay. Like, wait, hold on. That one is PK-8. That's the one I... Lord. Also, the... the Yes. You know something? Um, fun fact, I have been... I, I, I've been basically doing equivalent exchange from Full Metal Alchemist, where I just take their young and put them in my reactor, and it's like, oh, hey... Okay, uh, so. Artifact, where is. Oh, it's down there still. Holy shit, okay. Next to another. This is gonna be another sleeper fragment, isn't it? This is the first, uh, truck module that I have found. I like that the game just kind of gave you the jump jet upgrades, uh, like when you found the prawn in this one. Because I'll be real honest, I didn't even, I didn't ever build the last only truck module that I didn't. Yeah, like it seems like it's going to be the least useful, but. Yeah, the storage modules seem like they'd be a lot use more useful. Geothermal activity yeah. detected below. Beware of high pressure and temperatures. 
I will punch you, creature. Go away. Little mini Godzilla there. <laughs> yeah, they are interesting, like, creature designs. Like, they aren't really angry, angry. Like, they're just basically protecting their young, and I get it. But, like, I would not have any interest in their young at all. Docking. Oh! Yes. That one is far more useful than the sleeper module. Holy crap. If I could just build that, we could get into some docking. Where are you? Oh, hey, I just found Spiral Plant, which I didn't have. So I probably have to type on that. Right? Like, I feel like that was pretty lucky. Now, is that... Save. The pause while the PDA is up is really nice, by the way. I don't know if you messed around with that one. Uh, let's see. Do I actually have it, or do I need... Booster tank. Oxygen to give a speed boost? Eh, that's... Use the boost to give chase! Uh, let's see here. Nope, I still have to find... Oh, okay. That's that's what I expected. Yeah, I I don't know how you can do that, man. Like, <laughs> more power to you, but holy crap. Like, just the thought of all the storage space I would have to give up to carry food and water. Like, man, this is... We're just fisting real deep here, I guess. More power to you. Like, I don't begrudge anybody who does it or anything like that. Everybody, you know, play the game how you enjoy it, sure. I just... to exist in the game. The artifact you found contains traces of information suggesting what has become of my people. Uh Interesting. Technology acquired. Recyclotron. That sounds interesting. That here. Right after I pick up that lithium. And that lithium. Any 
more lithium. supposed to do it's supposed to put something on you that just it is that is that the extent of what I'm supposed to do It seems like that was all I was intended to find, is just the... That? There? Okay. Alright. Yeah, I know where it's at, so... I just... I just destroy the plant with my... Really? I just, there was a plant there. I absolutely saw it. Huh. Like you can control, you can accidentally destroy. Huh, okay. More lithium. Recyclotron. What does that thing do? Cycles items into their constituent parts. Oh, so oh wow. Okay, that's way better than a uh, just a trash can. All right, docking module fragment, all found. Means the sea truck is about to get more useful. Not that it wasn't useful before, but. Now we really gotta save. Now saving is super important because I do not wanna lose that, okay.
How far am I into the game? Um, I mean, without so I, I this is my this is a blind playthrough. I I honestly don't know how to answer that really because I don't know what the yeah I don't know what the metrics are for progress in this game yet. Uh, yes, I I did find the five ace where I got the prawn. I do have the map, yep. Okay, I can do that. One second here. Let me... Let me park this thing quick. Alright. Uh, my base is, uh... I have Alan. My base, uh, uh, smaps, smaps, smaps. Okay, so uh, so far I've just been to Delta and Phi. I have not. I have not been to. Oh, no, hold on. Okay, I have been to the... I assumed that Phi was the red one, but now that I see Phi over is the, green, is the teal colored one. Hmm. So I haven't been to Omega, and I haven't been to the purple or the teal one yet. I have been to the two that are in the center. Yeah, I realized it now. I... I I realized it once I saw that it, there actually was a phi on the map. Um, I don't know what I don't know what Greek character that red one is then, if it's not phi. Hold on, Greek alphabet. I it's kappa, really? I've never ever heard of kappa. I don't doubt you. I've just never heard of that letter before. Um, I don't, I have one, one s s piece of the snow fox. I need two more pieces before I have that blueprint. Are they really? So, would it surprise you to know that I had not actually scrolled down on this? I had just been looking at the map. <laughs> oh, shit. Okay, well, that's my fault. Uh, Sam's spy penguin drawing. I don't have the I don't have the little wind up penguin yet. All right. Uh, fact base. Cause I got some stuff to build. Ooh, more lithium. Ah, my inventory's full now, though. Sure. Have I ever played? I don't believe so, no. Why am I? Oh, this is gonna be so much nicer when I can haul the. on the back of the truck. It'll be like rolling up with my four-wheeler. Or in this case, a destructive mobile suit. Huh, okay. I am, uh, I am really itching to play, th to replay Breath of the Wild Master Mode.
Highly recommend. Okay. You're right. In the words of Captain America, I'll add it to the list. My, uh, my backlog. Sure, I'll do a base tour here in just a second. I actually just redid my base today. Um, let's see here. Gone home. Added. Yeah, you know, I looked at a bunch of different ways of doing it. I thought about making a spreadsheet or something, and I was just like, you know what? I can just, I can just jot them down and cross them off as I do it. You know. So when I beat one now, I cross it off and I put the date. And then if I want to play through it again, I put it back on the list and I just work that way. I have no set order that I'm working on them in. I just kind of like look through the notebook and I'm like, oh, that one sounds like fun to play. You know. Alright, so... Currently, I'm working with a two-car garage. I've got my big room, and I've got my two, two car garage here. Welcome aboard, Captain. All right. Uh, How do humans function with such a fallible and inferior body? Excuse you, my body is anything but inferior. I work hard for my body to be able to do what it does. Yes, but its overall form is not ideal. For example, consider its use of primitive ball and socket joints. Is there anything you don't find primitive? Humans bartered with evolution I mean, he's not to wrong. get more brain wrinkles and opposable thumbs. It is true, the opposable thumb is excellent. But all corporeal forms are temporary. The ability to be reborn when a body breaks down is paramount. My body is my own, and I cherish it. I mean, it grows with me. Humans have one. As I get older, I feel like the ability to be reborn into a form, new form shape. once the old one breaks down would we be very useful. For the next generation. Noble, but again, truly inefficient. You are incredibly frustrating. You know that. I hope to see the forms of my people again. Uh, I don't know. I don't know about the crystal caverns. I'm trying. I'm trying really hard to avoid spoilers. Let's see here, my robotic center to get yeah. Okay. Well that's cool. If you could if you could do me a favor though and just try to avoid spoilers, I'd really appreciate it. So I've got one uh I've this is my scanner room. I've got one uh range upgrade so far. That's what I need the magnetite for. It's a really simple base. I've got what I've got two mon two moon pools. Um, two moon pools, one for the truck, one for the thing. I, I've got a bioreactor, which is currently running on uh, root postules, because I don't know what else to do with them, and they are a pretty decent. I built a large room, and I've got my, my storage going. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not gonna get bent out of shape about it. That's why I just, yeah. People seem to really, I have noticed, since playing Subnautica 1 and now this one as well. Uh, I also have fish that like to swim through my base for no apparent reason. Um, apparently it works out well for them. Um, yep, my, my poster collection. Uh, um, let's see. I'm going to put some stuff away, though. Copper away here. Anyway, uh, and lithium. I'm gonna go get the rest of the stuff off the old out of the out of the trunk of my car. Did you ever have a base flood on you, Jam, when you played this? Because it it will definitely do it. hilarious and efficient 
I saw your that you had like stuck. Uh. Oh shit! Really? It is so tricky to get into the storage on this thing without. You built all your bases above sea level. That's not a bad idea. All right, lithium. Oh, that's not lithium. I think I'm good on lithium for the for the foreseeable future. Oh, I need a, uh, my dump locker. I, I mean, I wouldn't think so, but Jam would definitely know. fair. The, I could see the mono pool being... Oh, fucking hell, god. Ooh, check out the butt on that one. lithium than I know what to do with at the moment. Okay, well, that's, that's a nice problem to have. We're sticking the fuel rod that I found in there because I don't know. I don't have the, uh, words are hard. I had, uh, I had built like a, my, my original base was like a star shaped base where I had a multi-purpose room and then I built four directions out, and I attached a, mon a moon pool and stuff like that. Um, but once I got the big room, I decided to condense it down a little bit. So this is much more efficient than my old one was. I don't see a need for a booster tank. Ruby. I need Ruby. which is diamond glass and I feel like I got really lucky in that I found uh, diamonds right away
I could really do without. I mean, it, it's more realistic, but I could really do without the light, the lights flickering when I'm. All right. I don't know what the new depth on that thing is, but we'll find out here in a second. And apparently, there's a data box over there that I have to go. So we'll check that out here too. Uh, let's see. All right. So that's built. I can take that off my off my to-do list. And I don't have kyanite yet. Okay. It's just a yeah. So that's that's exactly why I don't like it. Um because I ha okay, the way that my monitors are set up, I have the game on my TV ahead of me. I have OBS over here, and I will usually keep my stream preview on my Surface Pro, which is down here. And so I get flicker, 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 and it really throws me off because I end up, it's like my lights. Hey, thank you so much new. for the follow. I really appreciate it. New. We've only been together an hour and 45 minutes. Um, yeah, so I get, uh, it makes me, like, my eyes bug out, and it's like I think that the the actual lights in the house are what's flickering. Um, but yeah. I just wish there was an option to turn it off. Advanced wiring kit, plasteel ingot, lead 3. Right, yeah, that's that's really what it comes down to, is like, I feel like there should be. Last steel ingot I can make. Because I has lithium now. I'm just going to put out the dump locker. Wiring kit, which is wiring kit and it's PPU. Copper wire. Carrying around lead in your hands is something you Now, I'm pretty sure I have to make that at the mo at the vehicle bay. Right? Like, is that what I'm going to have to do here? Uh, since I remember where my vehicle bay is. There it is. I see it. It's way over there. So, how do I get the truck? I mean, obviously, I just bring the truck over. Oh, I can actually just push it. Wow, that's kind of neat. Okay. It's really, it's really interesting to me. Like, uh, not that people like the game, because obviously it's a good game. It's really interesting to me just how um, excited people are when they come in and chat about the game. 
I I don't think I like nobody has come in and spoiled anything maliciously in the entire time that I've been playing the first one or this one. But they all seem to like just want to be like, oh yeah, then there's this really cool thing, and it's just it's it's really kind of neat. Obviously, I drive this out. So now we're we're sitting in the driveway, and I bring the trailer over, right? Automatically hook up. Please tell me. Okay, good. I was like, please tell me it automatically hook up, because if not, this is gonna be really. Well, we got ourselves a short bus. And I... I don't think... I can't dock that when it's like this, can I? I have to detach the sea truck to dock it, right? Find out. Oh. Oh, now you let me interact. Oh! Hey! What is this? Oh, no, I didn't want to eject you. Oh, god damn it. I just, uh, well, I mean, I had to pull levers, right? It's like, ooh, new buttons. Exactly. Yeah. You, you get me. <laughs> Could you imagine if I had done that over, like, over a really deep spot and just been like, oh, well, oh. Oh, there goes my prawn. Oh, no. All right. Uh, so, I got the body cash, I'm pretty sure. I can always go back to it if I don't. If I didn't get it all of it. I know right where it's at. Though. Patching it. Patching modules on the fly. Oh, cool. <laughs> uh Nope, don't push that. Okay, so the real question is, do I build the sleeper module just to have it? Probably not the worst idea. All right. Uh, unpin that one. Pin the sleeper module. Oh, that one's far easier to make. Okay. Three lead, one plasteel ingot, two arrow gel. Well, it's a good thing I got three lead. The pin system is fantastic. Like, it's, honestly, all these little quality of life changes really make me wish that the game had been, that this game had been released as an expansion to the first one, just so we would have gotten the quality of life upgrades.
I needed synthetic fibers, not aerogel. What am I thinking? Do I even know how to make synthetic fibers? I do. From that. Okay. Uh... So we're going to put the aerogel away because I obviously didn't need that. I don't know why I thought that was aerogel. I guess I can put that gold away. Okay, and it's gonna be. Well, now that would be fucking cool if they had one that did that. Uh, I need two of them, don't I? God, God, plastic game. All right, fine, fine. You win this time. I pinned, so I pinned the recipe for the the with the kyanite because I haven't found kyanite, but I'm kind of hoping that a sea monkey will just bring me random kyanite. Okay, now the question is, will it automatically reattach? No. Not here. They, hey, listen, they will apparently bring you Anything that you have pinned that is not a processed material. The blood moon has risen. Ganon is pissy. Yeah, I might as well fill up on creep vine while I'm here. I hate to ruin my dinner like that, though. Oh yeah, because of the uh, because of the top. Yeah, that makes sense. It's an oh really? All right, well. Oh, wow, okay. Huh. What a strange... Is that... I wonder if that's dev intentional? Or if it's just a bug? sense and it puts you right at the uh it puts you right at the controls too which is kind of nice Oof. oh there goes the paint so remember a moment ago how I didn't locate my mobile vehicle bay. Oh, I see it now. Yep, that makes a lot of sense. That's a that's a very good.
I guess I can unpin that now. I don't think I'm going to make more than one. All right. Uh, let's see here. What else we got? Can I just patch it that way, maybe? Hoping. Good, 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 good. Yeah, pull this ahead a bit. just reversing the truck into the modules. That's probably way more efficient. Alright, let's go check this bad boy out. <gasps> Portable jukebox! Picture frame. I mean, how do I not, right? I don't have any other records. What happens as you are speaking? I was being pulled from the logical world to the logical world. You at the center of the world. I was dreaming. The brain processes in mysterious ways when I sleep. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we're gonna go get a data box and then we're gonna go check out the next uh I could go down to six fifty now. Oh, you know what? We're gonna get this data box, then I'm gonna go check out the next artifact. There are theories, but every human dreams. Many other mammals too. Can be. We can experience impossible joy and also impossible terror. Sometimes I can fly. Sometimes I call out to Sam and hear Reacher. Sometimes I'm in my underwear, defending my doctoral thesis. It's a mixed bag. That defense grid on one. Is the most I, therefore hope you have many more of them. Maybe I don't understand. Slot one of four for the. Ah, uh, I'll have to check. Oh, uh, yeah. Ah, what the fuck? Really? Really? Yeah, I got the. Uh, it gave me that module for free. I don't need that. Don't need flares either. Get F away from me, you little shit. Lots of very interesting. <laughs> They're all just like floating above. Huh, okay. I don't need water. I don't need no stinking water. Oh, you can even hear it. Those are there on purpose, really? In the air, they're just floating in the air on purpose? Down, down, down. I mean, I can, I, I see that they're pointing me in a specific direction, but like,
Oh, it's the, uh, I get it. It's the... I know what those are. Those are the Wayfinder discs, right? Warning. 30 seconds of oxygen remaining. Yeah, those were in the first game. Alright. Yeah, that's the, uh, it gave me the defense module. I didn't even have to build it. Is it really? Oh, I see it. Is that right there? Is that what that is? I hadn't, so that's nice. I should, I don't think I have scanned this ice either. I don't know if I scan it, nope. I think it's kind of interesting that you can hear it outside the truck. Okay. So, let's see. I was kind of hoping, you know, uh, if, like I say, if I push circles, it's just going to spit me out. Okay. That's not a bad idea. Like, pause you for now. Looks like something I can do. Should have pointed it down. Didn't. Didn't think about it. Game. Really? No scan, huh? Okay. Fine. I see how you are. Um, I, I'm not gonna lie. Oh, what are you? Uh, are you an EMP jellyfish or? Uh, I'm gonna try something brave and stupid here because game likes to I think this game is an improvement in literally every way over the first one. Um, the Cyclops was neat, but it kind of made the base unnecessary once you got it. You know what I mean? And I do. I really think that this game has so far just been an improvement in every regard. 
pacing, uh, graphics, storytelling, quality of life improvements. Yeah, it's just digging it. I really think I I, I really do think that if. Uh, And again, I know I know that this wasn't the case, but I, I do think that if it had been released as an expansion and the first game benefited from the things that this one improved upon, um, I would have probably not that I didn't enjoy Subnautica one, but I think I ooh I don't know if I got am I gonna be able to fit through there. Your art. Oh god. Oh god, I'm sorry. Well, okay, so. Do I take the prawn? I mean, it's not really, it's not really meant for... It's not really meant for land traversal, but it's also better than Oh, you know what? Hold on. I'm not I'm not carrying. I don't need. Bye. Well, well, that's interesting. Using the truck to Oh, I literally have to go through there. Uh let's even fit. Sure won't. Okay, well. This is about to get interesting. Useful information. Processing. I can visualize a location where we may find an important component for the body. The image is hazy, but I am sure it is correct. The stark surface landscape. Dangerously cold. Curved spires stretch to the sky. Silver, you know what? I don't have a lot of silver, so I will take you. And I wish I could have brought the prawn in here, and I also need... What is causing that? Apologies for the crackly. One second here. What is causing that? My little streaming computer is just a serv is just a <laughs> it's a dual core uh Intel Core i5 NUC and uh sometimes it's just fine and sometimes it's like uh... Voice line is super important. I got distracted by my streaming PC. Visualize a location where. Okay, hold on. Nope, oh, that's my backlog. Wrong notebook. important component. 
Stark Surface Landscape. Dangerously cold. Curved spires stretch to the sky. I mean, it sounds like it's above ground. Just by landscape, but that could be deceptive. So we got over here. Well, I mean, I'm gonna take the silver. My other death was from uh, a heat vent. When I was I f uh, so when I went to uh, Papa, I did not find the front door first. I found I, I found the path through the heat vent, and uh, I died once due to due to the uh, planet expelling toxic gases from a spicy burrito right in my face. Curious. I know I don't have food turned on. Does that up my body temperature? Looks like it. That's a spicy bit the ball. Can I scan you? Huh? Yay! Pouch bulb. The bulb for your pouch. Oh no! No no! Get get on on on. Okay, there we go. Well, that's interesting. What do we got going on over here? I wish that I I know it's silly of me to say this before I even say it, but I do kind of wish that the jump jets worked a little bit better. using the snow fox thanks to uh, having seen that on your stream the, the heat the heat vents what is this oh titanium where are you get up there yet? No, I don't think I... Over here. I mean, 
might as well look around a little bit while I'm here. More titanium. More titanium! Limestone. Oh. And, honestly, the aliens leave power cords strung around over all over the place. It looks like, you know, the back of my entertainment center. go into the rock. You just go into the rock. Well, that was useless. Thanks, game. Like forgetting someone's birthday? I don't know, it just happens. When you die, some quantity of knowledge is lost forever to the next generation. Oh, those are really creepy looking. Holy you, crap! You call humanity inefficient one more time, I will swim us both into the mouth of the Leviathan. Is that sarcasm? I am still having trouble differentiating. They're kind of cool How looking, inefficient. but they're really creepy looking. Aside, does the loss of knowledge not create complications? Well, on a personal level, losing someone can be traumatic. But it's harder to process the idea of generational knowledge. Humans aren't networked, so we can't even be aware of what we're losing moment by moment. We try to learn from history. Maybe it's not ideal, but it's what we have. What happens when you no longer have the memories of others to combine with your own? You make your own memories and interpretations. You have to experience life as an autonomous being. Discover yourself. That idea is foreign to me. I can't even imagine not growing up and trying to, like, understand yourself. Being in a hive mind seems... You know, okay, like, Star Trek and stuff talks about, like, hive minds all the time, right? Like, you have a Borg and they're a hive mind, you have this entity and they're a hive mind, that sort of thing. And you have a general, like, you have a general, like, understanding of, of what that means, right? But I don't think I've ever really thought about it on, like, a philosophical level. Like, not having a sense of self. Because even with, like, even with, like, the Borg, like, for example, when they disconnected Hugh, Hugh still had his, his sense of self. Alright, we're gonna... So, like, it, it becomes a situation where, okay, so the Borg are a hive mind, sure, but they are still individuals within the hive and they just kind of function together this is like something else though this is like they don't even understand like where group ends Welcome and individual board, begins that's an interesting way of looking at it yeah
Grapevine seed cluster battery. Okay. Not right now. Well, we have explored. Yeah, and I mean, like, the, the from what I understand, the queens are basically, like, processing nodes. They, they kind of imply, like, I know that we only ever see the one queen, but there are multiple copies of her, seemingly, based on the fact that she was murdered in First Contact and then showed up again in uh, Voyager and then yet again in Picard. Um, yeah. Yep, yep. I could nerd out about Star Trek for I... No, oh, you bring that back. Seven of Nine was a great character. Oh, I need to build a recycler. That's what I need to build. Uh... Titanium and get ion cube. Okay. There was also the Unimatrix Zero thing, wasn't there? Where she was kind of like, it's been a minute since I watched Voyager. Hey, Gaia. Thank you. Uh, okay, Gaia, you have your choice. Do you want me to hydrate? Uh, oh, uh, oh, it's beer. It's always beer. Okay, I'm gonna have to go get a beer. I will be right back. I'm back. I should honestly just record myself making that sound effect and have it automatically play it. Would I do that? Cheers, everybody. <laughs> oh, that's that's a that's a big boy. Oh wait, no, it's small. What the hell, it looks big, but not small. Looks big, not small. All right. Tastes great, less filling. 
Where to put the Xerox? Okay, uh, let's see. Yeah. This hybrid technology allows for the recycling of natural resource components. I have anything to put in there. You know what, though? I don't really have anything to Xerox at the moment, though. But that's okay. You don't need to carry an extra. You know what? I'm gonna. I'm actually going to put one of my spare batteries in there just for storage. Okay. So what do I need to do now? Uh, it says here I've got a new recipe. That's it! I've discovered a new recipe! Ah, the Pathfinder tool. Sit on it. Listen. <laughs> I've never felt the need to Xerox my balls ever to anybody, or my butt to anybody. Like, that's just not a... Not a fascination I have had. Okay. Been to all of those. Been there. I guess this is Kappa Station. I need to rename. Oh, well, you know what? I'm not going to rename. have any cool audio recordings that we can listen to doesn't look like it alien statue energy generator fossil excavator water analysis station geological data Well, okay. There's Brian Wayne. Uh, I have not seen a wild one of those yet. I've only seen... I guess I could go... Uh, I guess we could go for... Now we could go looking at these other facilities that we have app for. Ugh. Altera facility. Okay. So, how do I figure out where? I mean, I guess. So, I guess I can figure out where I'm at, basically, with a straight line from because I can draw a straight line through Delta and and Kappa. Means that. I can kind of triangulate the, or I can figure out the direction of phi. All right. So uh, we're gonna have to turn on the beacon for, which is mislabeled. I'm trying to make the. All right. So. Delta's there, and Phi, which is actually Kappa, is there, then that means I kind of need to head. You know, I thought about picking it up, honestly, once I saw it, and then I was like, uh, I think I'll leave it, because it's, it's a good reference point.
Roadkill. Welcome back, guy. How was dinner? Roadkill. Roadkill. Toad kill. Toad kill, indeed. I'm gonna go fix the name, <laughs> cause now it's gonna bother me. You know what? I should also save. Okay. Saving would be good. Those weird penis penguins are creepy AF. Alright. Delta Station. That kind of means that it's like West northwest to get to I station, I guess. I'm gonna get eaten by a Leviathan, I can already tell this right now. was a crazy almost death. I was shocked that you actually managed to get back in the Seamoth. Hollow chamber in Iceberg Interior Detected. Uh, you wish to tell me where, computer? Or are you just gonna like... I don't get this. Like... Clearly the the PDA has like secret sonar powers or something. Am I supposed to just guess, computer? This looks like it's telling me to get out here. Fuck, I really, let's see here. Okay, can we do this? Oof, please don't do that. Whew. I don't like pointing, I don't like pointing the truck down and seeing nothing beneath me. It's like, 
Oh, well, okay. Yeah, I kind of have to use the truck as a platform to get out of the ice initially because it's like... Why... This thing does not do jump jets very well. On land. Well, this is very phallic. Hey, more batteries. Oh, water. Who gives? Ah, food cube. Who gives a shit? Okay. Is there a PDA anywhere around here? Huh? Uh huh. Yeah, I'm. I tend to just be a very defensive player on things. Like, in, uh, for example, in RTS games, I am always a turtler, and more often than not, it costs me the game, but I have a hell of a good time. I have a hell of a good. Oh, hey. Can I cut you open? No, of course not. Uh, fine. Fine game. Oh. We have a butt plug sticking out of the old uh, snow there. Okay. I really wish I had the grappling hook, to be honest. Titanium in a hole. Interesting. What's going on down here? Anything? Where are you? Frost vape frost base plant? Seems like a good thing to scan. I mean, I don't, I don't know what poops titanium. Colossus. Oh, hey. Bye, penguin. Ooh. New technology acquired. Sweet, we meet, we get to make. Uh... I don't know that I need one of those, but whatever. Oh, okay. Well, I mean, you know, Colossus from X-Men, he might do that too. You never know. If I stand on this while you go down? No. Of course not. not gonna let me go in there without uh. of course you're not okay well fine game fine we'll play it your way Phi robotics this is where Sam worked
Hey. New blueprint right. synthesized. Ooh. Looks like we're getting a bunch of new stuff. Sam loved working here with your spy pinglings. Do all humans like work? The lucky ones do. Are you lucky? I used to think I was. I mean, I've already got one, but I'll take the free titanium. Hey, another snow fox fragment. Yay! And PTA. Hey, Sam. Oh, hey there, pangling buddy. <laughs> Hi, Fred. What brings you this way? I was just passing by. Lillian wanted a hand with a deep dive out in the bridges. You know, I think she's right. There is some weird stuff out there. The clicking sound? SOS. I heard it with my own ears. So you think she's right? There's intelligent life down there? I don't know. I'll leave that to you scientist types. This scientist is more at home with these penglings. But if my sister was here, she'd be all over this. Wait. Are you telling me you're not the brains in the family? <laughs> oh, my family has many different brains. Like a... A hydra? Uh, well... <laughs> oh, yeah, actually, I, I like that analogy. Makes it hard to get along sometimes, but it's never dull. New blueprint synthesized. Uh, diving in too deep. Yeah, Fred. Fred's been pretty good. The uh, the boss the, is a little creepy though. The managerial one. He's. This must have been Sam's room. Something's not right. I mean, aside from the state of the place, yeah. I... Hi, you. How's everything at Pengling Central? <laughs> oh, fine. But I haven't heard anything since giving the footage to Zeta. It's been, what, a week? Did she promise you a report? No, but I expected some kind of reaction. Maybe I should take it up with Emmanuel. It is Kara, after all, and it could cause a lot of suffering if it got out. Why would it get out? We have professional containment and know how to neutralize it in an emergency. Sam, I love you, but you don't know what you're talking about. You love me? Wait, why do you know so much about this? It's my area of research. Why are you being evasive? <sighs> Oh, I'm gonna tell you something. Why are you being and evasive? And then you have to drop this crusade you're on before you damage your career. We're researching the bacteria. What kind of research are you doing? I don't want you worrying about this. Uh, we are aware of the possible downsides, but they're far outweighed by the potential. That's as much as I can tell you. <sighs> Sam. I, I need to think. I have to go. I need you to give me that last magnetite game. Fucker. Come on. Here, I'd listen. 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 I have found wild magnetite. I have a Pokeball. God damn it. Can't reach it. Yeah, the veins are really cool. This silver ore. You know what? I'm gonna take it. Yeah, I found the diamonds down in the heat vents while I was uh, making my way to Coppa Station. Which ended up being really fortuitous. I can't reach that one either. God. Uh, I feel like there's another entrance to this side here.
Okay, there's a large partition. You can just... Oh, it doesn't look like it's ending it. I, need a I don't need it. I don't need no stinking mask. Yeah, I'll take that, for sure. For you. For you, and why can't I interact with you? Hey, this is useful. Large flask. Hey guys, I'm so glad you're here. Where else would I be? Oh, like that's, I'd miss that's Red helpful. Being exposed Thank as you. The alien intruder. <laughs> that's not gonna happen. But you didn't say you were not the intruder. No, not this <laughs> argument again. I beg you. I think the game will settle this debate. <sighs> so, I just want to ask you something quick before Zeta gets back and we start playing. It's about the cavern with the frozen Leviathan. I investigated and... You I... investigated? When? I didn't see you. Maybe you were asleep or busy doodling inappropriate sea creatures. Those drawings are art. Anyway, I've looked into it. And I think we have reason to be concerned. It wasn't that long ago this planet was uninhabitable. But if we work together, we can get them to put an end to the Corral mutation experiments. Uh, I, I, I'm, I'm not comfortable with this. Samantha, you're paranoid. Come on now, you're Sam out. She has her safety at heart. And the rest of us don't? Zeta! <sighs> can we play the game now? Fine. I'm, I'm so oh. glad that Dungeons and Dragons <laughs> made it all the way to the side of the galaxy. We're recording audio, is that okay? Of course. I have the photos you sent. Um, what am I looking at here? Kara pustules on the frozen Leviathan. That's nothing to worry about in and of itself. It's well contained. The ice samples suggest it's been frozen since the time of the outbreak. The strain made the planet uninhabitable. If it mutates, All right, we're gonna have to go out are and get you some. feeling unsafe? Very. Uh, if I escalate this issue for you, will you feel comfortable enough to concentrate again? I have deadlines for the snow fox and the mining bots coming up. I really need your focus on the penguins. Oh, yeah. That's a relief, actually. I was expecting more of a fight. Nothing is more important than our safety. I'll take care of it, okay? Thanks. I won't let you down. <laughs> Thanks, Sam. Keep up the good work. Famous last words. I won't let you down. Don't need water. If, uh, I was kind of curious if, like, by the end of the original game, if water was, if water and the food cubes are going to end up being a thing that I could use to make something. Because it's like, since I was playing without food and water, I, I didn't have, oh, hey. I don't have an ion cube with me. One. Uh Ah, okay. There. Even look like it's powerable. That's interesting. Okay. Oh, it just lights up as you get near it. Okay. Turned on. IMAX sucks. Not seeing a spot to put a cube. So I'm going to assume that I can't do it yet. Look like it. 
So they were, uh... They were trying to build Stargate Command, is what they were trying to do. Okay, got it. Everon 7, locked and encoded. Lush. I don't need legs anyway, I don't understand why. They're overrated. So I still don't have all the pieces of the snow fox, do I? See, I got some, I got, I got some blueprints. Let's go. That's it. I've discovered a new recipe. All right, we got the cold suit. Snow stalker fur? What? Okay. Okay, well. That's the thing. I don't have the ability to make. I got the headlamp recipe. I have no ability for the whole series. I respectfully disagree. I think I think SG1 ended up being better in the end. But yeah, uh I loved the movie. Uh, okay, so I don't suppose the old woman, in the, the crazy old woman, will let me just trim a little fur off of her snow stalker. Water, of course. It, yeah, not playing without uh, playing without water and food turned on basically makes those chests completely useless if they've got water or food, which is unfortunate. Is there another piece of a snow fox around? Oh yeah, I was gonna check and see. Okay. Spy pengling remote. You have to build the remote and the pengling separately. Well, that's that's a little. But okay. Snow fox hover pad. So I suppose that means I'm gonna have to build a base on ground. Okay. Got that now. Looks good. More beds. Is this is this functional or is it just for decoration? Like Because if it's if it could food actually spoil in the in the other game in the 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 more serious mode? Hover pad does not require power for whatever reason. Oh, okay. But I still don't have the ability to make the snow fox, right? That's what I'm kind of taking away from this. Yeah, I'm still missing a piece. That's that's what that's a little what the fuck. Did you use quantum lockers at all when you were playing through? They're basically ender chests, right? Like Of course. Yeah, like I don't 
I don't see that being super useful. Like, I get the idea. I suppose if you really... Oh, what's down here? Ow. Thanks, thanks, robot. Don't need a food cube. Uh, I might actually need that. going on down here seems like a great place to get lost in this Well, this is quite pretty. This must be the hollow space in the, uh, the glacier that the computer was talking about. Plenty of silver. I'm actually pretty good in silver for the first time. You know, I'm thinking maybe I should have made the Pathfinder tool. Silver and copper, yep. I hear another thingy. Oh, fuck my life, where are you? Hold on. Uh, I don't know that I'm gonna be able to kill this thing. Wow, that sounded... All right. Magnetite, god damn.
All right, where are you? I heard you. I'm ready. Dangerous weather approaching. Seek shelter. How long does this weather last, I wonder? Doesn't look very dangerous. That's looking a little more dangerous. Hey! Okay. This gives me a course of action now. Go back and build the snow fox. So we're going to do that. I really thought I was going to get into a knife fight with a bear for a moment, but apparently that was not meant to be. not the way I came in. Or is it? Uh, Prawn is still there, so I guess it must be. Here. Friendly roars of friendship. Da 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 Oh god, I'm actually dying, holy shit. Ah! Yeah! Oh god. Nope. Nope, nope. Okay. Yeah! Yeah, you weren't expecting this, were you? Oh, ouch. Okay, well, yep, yeah, dead. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna reload because I don't want to lose stuff. Yeah. Uh, yeah. That's why we save.
I do wish that it would just reload your last save rather than spitting you back at base. I, I don't know why it does that. I don't know why the first game did that either. It doesn't make sense in universe either because it's like, okay, so is your base just cloning you since all your shit can be found out in the world? You know. That is a neat looking ship. It really is. I've always preferred like the more industrial looking ships to uh, the sleeker ones in space because it's like you don't really need aerodynamics in the vacuum of space. And once you start building ships in orbit, there's no sense to make them aerodynamic. That is a cute loading bar. All right, well, we're turning around. We're leaving. I will not fight. I will not fight bear. clearly need a snow fox, so. Which is not the same as a star fox. Welcome aboard, Captain. I could see that. I could I could see like smaller craft being sleek, especially if they're doing like maybe stuff where there's a lot of space debris. Then the idea of being st stuck in a small ass tube of metal and vacuum of space just has its own terrifying properties for those reasons. Smooth surfaces deflect radiation. I did not know that. There's, you know, it's missing from the sea truck. There's a, there's a 10 out of 10 feature that's missing from the sea truck. The Cyclops had. needs a horn. Uh, yeah. Satellite just makes sense. Okay. That's true. That's, that's, yep, I, I used to work for a, a TV station during college, and so, yeah, we used to tune dish different things. Yep, that makes a lot of sense. Me and a buddy of mine from... Okay, here's a fun story. So, me and a buddy of mine, uh, while we were in college, worked for uh, a, a TV station that rebroadcasts foreign news and entertainment programs from around the world here in the, here in the U.S. That's all I'm going to say. Enough. 
about who they are. Um, but, so they would actually, we would actually have to tune the satellites in to get the different broadcasts and record them for playback. Well, uh, we had access to these raw satellite receivers, basically. Welcome aboard, Captain. And I don't know if you've ever had the, the pleasure or frustration of dealing with a raw satellite receiver, but there, at the time, was a lot of porn out on the airwaves. And my buddy and I worked the midnight shift, so we would come in at like 11.30 and we would be there until like 8. And, uh... Our, our, the company would use super VHS tapes and basically once they got to a certain age would just toss them in a bin and say ah, if you need one, take one, doesn't matter you know because they were no longer fit for a broadcast so we uh, we had, we had there were, there were blocks of time where you were not using a satellite dish for a while and so we uh <laughs> we re we actually decide we actually did the number crunching and figured out that we could leave a satellite dish completely open all night by just recording the programs for that one on one of the other dishes so we we broke out the old debit card and paid for a subscription and in order to keep our boss from figuring out, because if you just tuned to it, you would see that there was an active subscription running on this porn satellite. Um, we uh, we went into the configuration on the receiver and would always knock it off by a degree or two so that if you tuned to that satellite, it would misalign and it would just give you static. And so um, we'd sit there and we'd record porn all night. And just, we weren't watching it. We were just, we'd literally walk in, set things up, put a tape in and hit record and then do our jobs and then make sure to change everything back for, you know, f before the morning shift and go home, right? And, uh, never got in any trouble whatsoever. But, oh, I, I'm sorry, I said we worked the midnight shift. We worked the evening shift. This other guy that we knew, Al, worked the midnight shift. And, uh, we were good friends with Al. So, <laughs> one day, Al comes up to us and he's like, hey, so I don't know who did this, but there is an active porn satellite. <laughs> and he had been coming in <laughs> And once he figured out that there was an active porn satellite, he didn't know how it happened. But he was also recording, like, eight hours of porn on his shift. <laughs> oh, shit. I don't know how he figured out that the satellite was a degree or two off. Because those were not satellites that we had any reason to tune into except to view scrambled porn or porn you know like uh, that's one of my best memories from from working there and it was it was such a throwaway job in college I literally took the job so that I could sit there yeah 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 he was turning dials all right and so yeah um one of the best memories I have from working that job, because that job was purely so that I could work a little bit every hour when we'd start new recordings or start new playback. And then for the rest of the hour, I was doing homework. So, yeah. All right, I have magnetite again, and I need uh, copper. I need copper, so I just I put all my copper away. Bad idea. 
Alright, we're gonna run down to the scanner room quick. Oh, and I also have a disc, don't I? Yeah, I'm pretty sure I have a disc now. But is that on me? Do I have that on me? Or is that in the prawn? That's... that's... <laughs> I actually don't have a VHS player anymore. Like, honestly, it got to a certain point where we just had, like, framed art. Do I need to put it? Wait, hold on. Do I actually? I, well, I should take stuff out of here anyway. Um, we, we honestly, like, never even watched a fraction of what was recorded. Because by the time it was done, by the time the month-long subscription ran out, we just had so much porn. Like, more porn than you could consume reasonably. song. Oh, it's because it pauses it. Sure. We do, we have music for the lab now. How are you doing, Tetra? Welcome. Hope your night's going well. Alright, we got wiring kit. Jam and Tetra, I think you guys probably have seen each other before. If you haven't, um, Jam, Tetra, Tetra, Jam. I like this. Good song. That makes my heart happy. I figured you two probably were aware of each other. Let's see. Hmm. 
Magnetite. Lube. Battery and titanium. Okay. a thing that I have to build at the vehicle bay. Oh, really? Have I heard his partner playing Dr. Mario with you before? Is that... Fabricator. Okay, well, this is frustrating. Uh, not in there. No, there. Where do I? It's not at the. I didn't see it at the vehicle thing. Remember where you make the snow fox? Or do you have to build a pad and then make it from the pad? I wonder if you have to build it from the pad. You know, that would actually make Welcome sense. Welcome aboard, Captain. Because... Okay. All right, so that makes that makes sense. <laughs> the pad is deployable. Interesting. So you could pick it back up then. Okay. Because I knew you could pick up the motorcycle. So 
So, Tetra, you might even be saying that you are staring at that spot. The pad is not deployable. Titanium in a wiring kit. Okay. Ways cry sweet anxiety. Another sleepless night. Oh, we're gonna make the wiring kit first. Lucky I'm alive. Yeah, I know I'm far from home, but I'll survive. I'm jumping right. enough because uh, I'm gonna go over there again and I really want to make sure I have enough I don't want to get over there and find out that I'm missing like two silver or something okay I should have everything I need so Oh, that's really smooth. That worked out really well. Okay. Uh, let's turn on. I guess we can turn off copper station. C truck doesn't have a fine name. I was really, you know what? I was really hoping that, uh, I honestly, I I have it. I uh, actually had a really good idea. Now, I'm gonna ask a question. If I color the the truck part, does it automatically color the the modules? And I suppose I should put it in the one that has the. There's a, it's a very important question because this would not have been nearly as funny. Uh, that's the worst. Well, we're gonna have to go with that. That's that's roughly roughly the right color. No, 
No, I can't do 3,000. Okay, well, compensator. There we go. Oh, I forgot to color the inside. Oh, no. Game. Dock. Alright. Let's see here. Ooh, that changed. Wait, why did that change the outside? Oh, I fucked it up. God damn it. No! Sub hype, yes. Watching Desi try to brute force that subcode. Oh my lord. game what was what is even happening right now what the fuck shit shit This is fine. It's all it's all fine now. Everything's working. Everything's working exactly as intended. I can't get out of this thing is the problem. Yeah, if I loose well that's really it does not like that at all like it does not understand what I'm trying to do right now okay can I I I know what I have to do to fix this I don't want to do it Yeah, it really does not like that being right there at all. Okay. Uh... I have a theory that that's that that putting that there is what broke that.
Yeah. I just... I, I really didn't want to have to... Okay, let's... I don't think that's going to fix it, but we're going to see. It sure did. That's exactly what it was. Wow. Just like dock them. There we go. All right, save. <laughs> that was one of the more interesting bugs I've encountered, and I I really haven't encountered a lot of bugs in this version. I will take bugs like that over just crashing to the to the PlayStation OS again. Like, knock on wood, this game has not crashed yet. The the original crashed a lot. Got flying in the first game. <laughs> Roadkill. We're starting to see eyeball jellyfish, so I know I'm going the right direction. Oh, hey, we got an actual pontoon. What's this? What is this? Oh, I didn't even see this here the first time. Huh. Zeta, I have kind of a funny question for you. Have you picked up any kind of unusual interference during any of your robotics work? You mean like Parvin looking over my shoulder and telling me I'm assembling my circuits wrong because it's not how his dad did it back in the day? <laughs> no. Like electrical interference in the audio or video. Any kind of flickering or clicking. Huh, can't say that I have. Why? so it doesn't extend as far as the bay. What doesn't? When Fred was bringing me for my eval, we detected something, almost like an SOS. Air Delta? How retro. What was causing it? I think architects are trying to communicate with us. You always think that. Look, it may be my job to always think that, but I'm very good at my job. Not that HR seems to care. I won't breathe a word of this to Emmanuel. Thanks. You're a good friend. Oh, I don't have titanium. Are you fucking... Wait, I was here, I thought. I must... I must wait, there must be... Oh, God, I don't need a food cube. Why did I take a food cube? Hey, do some... I thought Permia imminent. Okay, 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 okay. Just... Chill. Literally. Uh... 
Can you time butt spot out? <laughs> you can set it to ignore you, you know. Um, if you go to uh, go to butt spots chat and you type exclamation point ignore me, it will, it will not. Uh, oh well, this is this is lovely. Not wrong. I need, I need one titanium. Grr. Where am I going to get one titanium here? There's literally limestone. I don't know why I'm like, where am I going to get titanium? Hey, look, titanium. Wow. Now this is pod racing. Oh, what are we gonna call this? Hmm. As I freeze to death while I'm, God damn. We'll, we'll name it later. Well, at least I at least it warms me while I'm on it. That's nice. Oof, it kind of a little chunky in how it handles, but that's okay. Yeah, I like the idea of butt spot, and uh, how do I, can I pick it up? How do I pick it up? There. How? How? How pick up? Pick up? Can't pick up. Inventory full. Fuck. Did not account for that. Wait. How big is that goddamn thing?
Okay. That's pretty big, actually. I really need... I really need fur. So we're gonna do something a little dumb again. I like the idea of butt spot, but yeah, I, I have had it, I have set it to ignore me as well. Jet, hi there. Uh. Oh God! <laughs> hey there. Uh. Fuck. Well, uh, I I didn't I don't remember what this part of the plan was. Hmm. Mm. All right, fucker. That's right. I'm gonna stab it. I'm gonna stab it repeatedly until it stops moving. That's my plan. What the? Oh. Yes! Stab! Stab! Ha ha! Ha ha ha! Ha ha! Ha ha ha! Oh wait, what? What? Game. <sighs> After all that work, God, you know what? We're reloading. You can't harvest their fur? <laughs> uh, yes, the magic, delicious heart cookies. Eat up. You deserve it after committing murders. <laughs> Guy Lysrife cheered X100. He just wanted to say hi. That, thank you for the 100 bits, Guy. That was an amazing use of that alert. Yep. You can't harvest their fur then? How are you supposed to get their fur then? If I may ask. Because it seems like the knife would be the only realistic way to get their fur. Remember how I said the game had not crashed yet? I think we just hit that point where the game was like, I can't. I mean, I don't know if there are clippers in the game. I don't think we found anything that would function like clippers in in the original 
like the knife was basically how you harvested everything that you couldn't just pick. So I was assuming that the way that you got the fur was to go all Kermit the Frog in Muppet Treasure Island on the snow creatures and then you would get their fur. Hmm. Listen, I know they're supposed to be penguins, but all I see is a penis with feet. Penguins. <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right. Round two. Well, if nothing else, I get to scan it now without fearing my for my life in the process. No? No? Really? Oh, okay. Well, now I'm confused. Because that's definitely how the game, like... Hmm. Is there a... Data entry on there for... Oh, we got new logs. I suppose we did pick up a couple, didn't we? Okay. Ah. Uh. Mm -hmm. Get a research probably. Data. Indigenous life forms. No stalker. Okay. Is a bear like evolutionary offshoot of the aquatic stalker? Really? Okay. Okay. Well, I kind of need their fur. In order to make the, uh, I don't need any copper or silver right now. Although that man, the, uh, the impetus is strong. Just grab it all, but I don't need it right now. All right, Jam, I would take a minor spoiler on this one if you don't mind, because... I really do kind of need their fur to make the... Thermal suit. <laughs> Do 
There are caves with fur on the ground. So not this one. Well, shit. Oh, I wonder if they're, I wonder if you're talking about penguin nests. I believe there is, in fact, one around here. I have to remember. Oh God, you're gonna. It's amazing if those things actually heat your body up. So, oh, shit. <gasps> I guess it really wants you to have to just use the snow box for this area, and I get that, but. Oh, because it's out of the water. I was like, what? What is happening?
Not that I need it, but I'm kind of curious. So glad it has a headlight. Dangerous weather approaching. Seek shelter. Something wants to eat me. Penguin spot anyway, we can have fun exploring this while we're while the weather passes. Okay. No fox, no fox remote makes a slight roar sound. I assume it sounds like an actual fox. Oh. Uh... Words. Words. I mean... Okay, so there's yeah, so they just they just find minerals, right? Or are there actually t uh, you know what? I don't want you. To I wonder if there will be times when uh, I have to use them to get something. <laughs> One has a tighter grip than the other. Well, that's good. Can I like? Why would you want to self-destruct one of those?
Yeah, I saw that, and I was like, why would you actually want to do that, though? Now I feel like I could build a scanning base here. Now, according to Jam, this makes a roaring noise when it's in your butt. Don't need water purification tablets. Sure don't. That'll take. That I don't need. It sure as hell is that. Okay. Yeah, Dangerous like, weather approaching. Seek shelter. You can see why I might think that was the, uh, like a snow stalker or something, right? Like, I have, you know what? I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna pick up any more because I don't have much space. Well. I guess. If you're not cheating, then you won't mind if I record this conversation. Is that right? Hey. I have nothing to hide. Then what were you whispering about with Vin? Nothing. Th that guy is so lawful good, it's annoying. Wait, so you were trying to cheat? But no cheating occurred, so what does it matter? It matters to team morale. If you can cheat in the game, how can they trust you out there? I'm sorry, did you feel left out? Perhaps you would like to make a deal. Ugh, Parvin, no. You're shameless. You really never give up, do you? I don't. That's true. <laughs> Have a manual put that in my next eval. Very persistent. So he was cheating at D&D, that's pretty lame. My dearest Adeline at Rosita. Ugh, my dearest. Who says that anymore? Adeline, Rosita. Everything on the mission is going very well. Do you see now? Your doubts were unfounded. I am loved here, and... Oh, no. Rosita will say, Papa, why do you have to brag all the time? Papa, it's embarrassing. Right, like... I want to apologize. Okay, no, that's taking things too far. If you have to cheat at D&D, &D, then note, you're not really interested in just want you to know having a, I love a you fun with your I friends. You. I don't know why I say the things I say sometimes. They just come out. I was going to send you a message saying how great everything is here and how everyone loves me. I've had a promotion to a very important security dossier. I'm treated like a hero. But really, this is a cold, wet planet. The scientists are full of themselves. There's no action to speak of. The only thing I look forward to is weekly games of Alien Intruder, but more than that, of coming home to you. I am sorry for all the times I did not appreciate you, of our family, or the good life we had. And I... What's the use? 
I don't know. Some people just journal to get that stuff off their chest. Here. I sent so many things here. Dead among them. Oh my fucking what the This was Sam's necklace. She never took it off. Well, apparently she did. Investigation of the fire excavation site, including the cave entrance and surrounding area, revealed minor cosmetic damage to Altera survey equipment and significant structural damage to the natural cave entrance and supports. Resulting debris prevents cave access without heavy excavation equipment. Only foot access is currently possible. We are reporting two casualties, Pavan Ivanov and Samantha Ayu. Both bodies were found beneath the rubble at the cave entrance. Ivanov had just entered the cave. Footprints were still visible by the entrance. Deeper into the cave, Ayu appeared to have sustained a fall. Poor souls. What was Ayu doing? Nothing in her file suggests a history of vandalism or carelessness. And yet... I can only conclude that the cause of the collapse was employee negligence. We will need to investigate a possible connection to the explosive damage reported at Omega Lab. If there is a connection, who is responsible? Oh. It appears that your sister's death was accompanied by significant destruction. Doesn't make any sense. She would never destroy a base. Well, baselessly. But your feeling is confused. I am detecting more than one. I, I don't know. I, I feel... disillusioned? Worried? I thought I knew Sam better than I really did. When we were kids, I was always the one breaking and rebuilding things. She wouldn't even go into a bake sale without a plan. For classic oatmeal cookies, no less. So serious. She wouldn't have anything to do with my molecularly transformed caramel pretzel lumps. Your mind goes easily to food. <laughs> to distract Me too. Feelings. Okay, I think that's enough mind reading for now. This wasn't negligence. That's not Sam. This was something else. It just offered me to scan something. Angling? Yeah, it was. So, yeah. Uh. And it's still got the alien virus. Oh, great. Hey, you know what? I don't actually have any of this. Uh. So they found Godzilla. Got it. Can I go up the elevator? Got it. Oh, of course I can. The incredibly slow moving dipping mechanism. Synthetic fibers, fiber. Oh, there's so much good stuff there. Grr. Listen, uh. Drop. Uh, 
We're gonna pick up the egg fibers for now. Frozen creature's skull. What is this? Insert sample requires injectable container to function. What? What even is happening right now? Oh, Grody. like cured this thing in the last game I mean obviously this specimen is frozen so it's still got like still got some of it left but oh I wonder if that's why I wonder if that's why you have the uh, the large <laughs> flask things that were laying all over shit And I definitely Let's see if there's one around here. Take one? Is that what you're trying to tell me, game? I mean, I don't really want to carry it in a thermos because, you know, soup goes in there, but. That doesn't look like I can make one. Do I just have to come back with one? Is that that the plan? Dear Altera, how about and I'm just spitballing here we put the flashlight on top of the scanner Excavation site, day 33, morning. I thought I saw something moving on the screen, but it was just that I sneezed. <laughs> Wiped it off. Fred's not convinced the Leviathan is really dead, but I've never even seen it blink. Nevertheless, I am now undertaking the mandatory foot patrol. Inside the cave, confirming a whole lot of nothing. Creature still dead, cave still boring. I miss the mining site. At least you could talk to people. Oh, wait now. What's this? A rock. I found an interesting rock. That makes three this week. The others will be happy to have a friend. Concluding patrol. Perimeter secured. Nothing to report. End log. All right. We're going to... Uh... I think we're gonna have I I assume I am going to have to come back with a container because we saw those containers at the other the the outer by base so I'm assuming that I need to get one of those bring it here and then that would that'll activate that but let's see that is pure assumption But it's my current working theory. So.
I mean, it's okay. I have to go back and unload my inventory anyway. What the hell was that? Oh, God, I am... Did I make a wrong... I made a wrong turn. I am in a... Okay. Well... That's good to know. Nice creature killed. Uh, okay. Alrighty. Enjoy your lurk. Judging harder than Alan. Dangerous weather approaching. Well, Seek crap. shelter. Uh. Uh. No. Yes, I know. I'm. I'm about to freeze to death, and I don't like this. Can these heat me up? Please tell me these heat me up. Oh, they do. This would be where having a storage unit on the uh, on the truck would be really handy. Something up there, too. Ooh. Ow. Well. I have detected an energy. 
Yoshi's signature of some strength. I am not sure what it is for. Go ahead and share it. Can't hurt. Signal location uploaded to PDA. It did, literally. It's the uh it's the the festival of the jellyfish from are you? Butt spot's been on fire tonight. I'm sorry. It's really hit or miss on some of the streams I've seen, but man. It's fleshy colored out here. I don't understand. Seem to be able to do anything with that. Uh, that's weird. I'm gonna let you recycle that. Okay. That. to carry around like 62 batteries. Very important that we have a wall of posters.
And yeah, some of the creature designs are really neat. And some of them, and they are equally, like, WTF as well. You're right. I'm out of lead. Fish, what are you doing? Stop swimming through my base. Okay, this is gonna sound really silly, but this is gonna drive me nuts, so. You're not wrong. How dare you? Ways cries with anxiety. Another sleepless night Long way from society Lucky I'm alive Yeah, I know I'm far from hope But I'll survive I'm jumping right in Through the days Just on my bed Not going without a fight I know it seems silly, but the fact that it fades in and out really bothers me
I jump. Okay. Diving into the Yeah, I know I'm far from home. I'll survive. I'm jumping right in. My bed and I go without a fight. I'm diving into the Okay, polyaniline. Don't need to make that very fun. Okay. So I think. Back to Phi. I'm gonna head back to Phi. We're gonna pick up that container. And we're gonna see if my working theory is correct. And if that's not the case, then, uh,. I guess we'll go hunt for the other artifact that popped up on our, our radar. That's really the only thing I can think to do at the moment. I guess we could go look for more um, fur in the uh, we go look for more fur in the uh, place. Ah, yes, the good old compensator. Okay.
that didn't work. Aw, these little butt plug mushrooms are so cute. I am gonna need more titanium, but I'm gonna hold off. I don't wanna fill up on snacks before the before dinner. I feel like I'm not made to get up there yet. I don't We're going to build a small base here, I think, actually. Imminent. You know what? We're gonna we're gonna put a pin in that. Room. That is something I think I am going to do. But I don't know if this is the best place to do it.
kind of wish it would just hurry up and get the day. Oh, I think maybe there's a bed in there. Sleep in. Let's see. Be nice if it let me advance it. Won't actually let me use that one, that's fine. This one? No. Uh, okay, so I'm stuck kind of. Drive back to the truck, but I. By the time I drive back to the truck and sleep, I'll already be dead. Actually, save. And I am going to go use the little streamer's room, and I'll be right back.
All right. Sorry about that delay there. Cheers, everybody. I need to find... That looks like it's starting to turn into... God damn it. Well, that's pretty. So I can see now, so that's nice. When did I get below zero? I got it while I was still playing Subnautica 1. <clears throat> I just started it. This is my third day of playing this. How are you doing, Jackaboy? Hope your night's going well. I, uh, I really wish there was a mod, like, obviously not on PS4, because PS4, right, but I wish there was a mod that, uh, oh, cool. I wish there was a mod that let you play Subnautica 1 with the, with the Below Zero engine, because there's so many little upgrades. Oh, hey there. Uh. Oh, 
That was darker for her. Okay. Well, now I can finally make uh, thermal undies. Still need more though. I need to be able to make the headpiece and the gloves as well. Are messing around with the Reaper. They are in Subnautica One. There. Oh, hey. Like we got more Snowstalker players here. So let's go poke the bear, literally. Oh, hi, Mama. Ow. Ow. Did I just kill a mother who was raising pups? Yeah. Do I feel bad about it? A little. Not gonna lie. Like I'm I'm not I'm not cruel. But I also kinda needed the resources. Well, I don't 
don't see is how I have a choice here. It's it seems like it's time to make a new base. I don't know. Shit. Okay, well, I certainly did not expect that to happen. Uh. Hypothermia imminent. Yeah, I need a piece of quartz. Emergency power only. Oxygen production offline. Oh, stop. Girl, I did not need to pick up snow. Uh, what I do need is solar power I need. More points. I'm betting there's one probably just sitting around. Thermal, but I don't have the components I need. Now we're gonna get back on the bike quick. Dangerous weather approaching. Seek shelter.
Well. Crap. Definitely wasn't anticipating Mom and Bear. Seek shelter. Interesting that you can dive down. I didn't really know what that is, and I don't really want to find out. Bird, I thought it was a piece of quartz for a second. One piece of words, so. If I could get a solar panel on that thing, it would work really well, I think. Stock up of players. Anium.
gotta be the penguins, right? Okay. Quartz, 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 quartz. Well, he's adorable. I don't really want to feed him to my uh, reactor, though. if this is a good idea or a bad idea. Oh, it looks like idea like there was quartz just sticking on the ground there dangerous weather approaching seek shelter okay i just need one piece of quartz that's it Quartz, quartz, where to be? Yeah, that or I just abandoned this idea, which is starting to seem more feasible, honestly. I thought it would be nice if I could have, like, a little itty bitty just spot to warm up, you know? Wasn't even looking for anything fancy. But, doesn't seem like it's meant to be. So, we're going to keep ascending the mountain here. I don't know what's up here. But I'm just kind of curious to see, A, how high can I go? And there we go. Come on, man. And there's no really B.
reach the top of the mountain, do you think? Oh, it kind of looks like I can go further yet. back at the beginning. I just loop. Shit. I did. I looped completely around. Okay, well. Alright, I guess that answers that question. Uh, okay. I'm gonna go explore elsewhere. My curiosity had. Oh, there's another piece of quartz. God damn it. <sighs> My curiosity about this place has been satisfied for the moment. There's two pieces of quartz. Okay, you know what? Listen. Listen, game. If you're just gonna taunt me now. That's just mean, game. For the record, that's just that's just mean. Thought we were friends. Hypothermia imminent. <sighs> okay, I uh, will. I don't think there's quartz there, game.
hyperthermia imminent. <laughs> What else have you been playing, Jackaboy? I know you said you're playing Subnautica in between games. Game, there is not ports there. Hey, there we go. Let me put it out here and actually power the thing. I don't think. Power restored. All primary systems online. Welcome aboard, Captain. Okay, well, hey, that worked. I did not expect it to. But I'll take it. Oh yeah, I know I'm lit, so... <laughs>
Hmm, I can make... All right, we'll be back. I am gonna go back to base and get some, literally no point. Haul it around, do I not haul it? I'll leave you there. save. We're gonna go doing a little I don't know how deep this thing is. But we're saved. So if I die it's not a tremendous setback. Roadkill. Plenty of quartz and copper there. Okay. Roadkill. Entering ecological dead zone. The prospect for survival is fast approaching zero. That's uh, going to be a reaper. I heard it. Down the edge of the map, though. Didn't really intend to. Well, this looks more promising. Oof, did not get stuck. Temperatures detected in mineral rich fissure below.
Okay, can't go that way. Well, I mean, I can. I would prefer not to go that way. Ah, cool looking. Holy shit. Oh my lord. It's a giant ass jellyfish. What the hell? I'm past the bronze. Oh shit. Not realize. Well, okay, I guess we're doing this the manual way. Not crazy about this, but... this artifact, I am again able to trace the imprint of my people. They survived for a time, but then their presence becomes faint. New technology acquired. Ooh, okay, well... That uh, very much made this worth it. Okay. Vent Garden. Faster. Warning. Thirty seconds of oxygen remaining. Okay. The vent garden harvests geothermal energy to nurture the life that grows within. That's pretty fucking cool. I should save. You know why I should save? Because I just got some new technology. I don't want to lose it.
That's not a good sound. sorts of life forms I could scan there, but my priority right now is getting to Oh, hey, there's a rock. On the other side of Delta Island, okay. Road kill. A lot of people can't drive at night. I actually find night driving very relaxing. The hardest time for me to drive has always been uh, dusk and dawn. I don't know what it is, but it's like I get really like sleepy when I'm trying to drive into a sunset or a sunrise and I... Very strange. Well, that's good. 
Let's see here. Can't recycle batteries. Well, that's silly. Wait, hold on. What? Oh, it just won't let me recycle an empty battery. That's so silly. we got over here we got some other new recipes some new recipes thank you I am power cells just two ion batteries okay Animal fur. Uh, let's see. We got... Kevlar microfiber and insulated with an alpine yoke around the neck and shoulders. The cold suit is designed to delay the onset of hypothermia. Take a deep, deep dive. I take a guess where I got another. Oh, yeah, I need to build a power. I remember, I need to build a power cell uh, charger. 
Advanced wiring kit, lithium, titanium. Wiring kit. Wiring kit. Circuit. Or plus a CPU. So. Insulate a helmet to provide protection for the cold. I I feel like it wants me to swap back and forth the clothes, and I'm I'm not a big fan of doing it. Whatever. Emergency power only. Oxygen production. Oh yeah. Because it has no juice, because I took a power cores out, shit. Well I guess. Oh wow, okay. Nickel. I don't have nickel. I don't need nickel. I'm an idiot. Uh, synthetic fibers, ruby, enamel glass. I can make. Let's see. Fibers. Lead, aren't I? Fuck. I can unpin. That recipe. Lead. God.
I think where I can get lit right off the top. Should be all around me, actually. Honestly, by the time I get into that thing, it's so Well, it says lead, but it's clearly quartz. says lead, but it's not. Uh, okay, well. So... I don't understand why the game is protecting the wrong items. It's really annoying. That bug makes the scanner room pretty much worthless. Welcome aboard, Captain. One piece of lead. Got this.
Yeah, I'm putting this stuff away for now, but I don't even need it. So. Excuse me a little more. Okay. Salt. Silver. chair is not the most comfortable thing, but it holds me, so yay.
Okay. It sounds like it's D-Sling, which I think, I really like this prawn so much better than the one in the first game. Eggs are good. Crush depth now seven hundred. Excellent. I really need the copper or the ribbon plug thing. So So I can Pionite, yeah, that's gonna be a Huh, you know, I could actually make that. Uh. 
to I think fibers again. Uh can't remember. Oh, yes I do. I just I already have the mark two. God damn it. Welcome aboard, Captain. Okay, well that's oh. It'd be nice to find the uh, storage module or the grappling hook for grappling hook for the prawn or the storage module for the uh, Truck.
gold, silver, lithium. And a wiring kit. Wow. Okay. I mean, I have silver, but. Expecting that. All right, well, the truck should be way more. Yeah, uh, getting the ion batteries that early, really, that, I like that a lot better. That makes the progression a lot neater. <laughs> Taking my melatonin now so I can fall asleep here in an hour. Hey there, yep, I have a snow bike now, which is, uh, it's okay. It handles a little wonky, but, uh, let's see here. How are you doing tonight? got going on here. I'm doing all right. Doing all right. I've made some really solid progress in this game, um, which is nice. I feel like I need to Going back to where I got that artifact because I know that there was a big ass diamond vein down there. And 
now that my prawn can actually go down that deep. What the fuck is it? Turn it off. It is green. Even seen it around the edge of the screen though. There it is. It was not there. Like it, it did not reappear until I. My uh my my C truck now has a uh, sleeper cab and a docking spot for the prawn for the prawn suit. I have made it flesh colored and called it compensator. I've discovered a, or not discovered so much, I used the map to get to a third um, facility base that the, the uh, <coughs> Altera Corporation had set up where they were, work, where they were making um, Oh, are they doing it? Sorry, guys, I didn't interrupt your mood. Um, I found a little penguin robot that I can use to go into penguins' dens and uh, get minerals and stuff out of there. Um, I murdered a few polar bears, basically because I thought they would give me fur, and uh, murdering them does not actually get you fur. Uh, what else was there? It's been a very good night so far. I started way early tonight. I decided, uh, I normally do movie nights with a buddy of mine, and I just, after working all week and everything, I just needed a, like a night to recharge, especially since I'm going right back to work tomorrow. My temp gig ends at the end of this coming week, so... Oh yeah, and I, I, I explored this behemoth. Wait, hold on. Is this the behemoth I explored? Or is this a different one? Yeah, it's the one I, it's the one I explored. Okay. I was worried there for a second. I was like, uh... Yeah, I basically started right after dinner tonight. These things are neat. They look like giant jellyfish. But the description on them makes them sound like they're artificial, but I don't think they are. I think they're like a naturally occurring organism. I'm s Yeah. Ninety-nine percent certain that there is, or, or not a reef, but Leviathan around here. Ah, I really would like to go scan that, but I'm afraid I'm gonna get eaten. Here's the, here's the really, really big one. Yeah. 
arc right here. This is so unnerving. Don't have a grappling hook yet, nope. Nor do I have a storage module for the truck. That's that's the next thing I'd really like is the storage module. I do, however, have a jukebox in the truck, and I can listen to music while I'm in the truck. I also have a jukebox in the base now. So, oh, we have new emotes. Uh, so Twitch approved my my lurk emote and my uh, lewd emote, and also the WTF emote. So we have those now. Just knocked those out of the park, didn't she? Okay, now I want to see what's under here because. There's a hole now. And... Well, sometimes a hole is just a hole. Okay. <laughs> Listen, Butt's Bot has been knocking it out of the park tonight. Like... So tonight was your uh, your weekly tabletop game, right? Listen, robot, pick up the damn thing. Jesus. I've already scanned that. I basically just came back down here for the diamond. But I'm also going to get some uranite while I'm here. Because I... Welcome aboard, Captain. Eventually I'm going to want to make a nuclear reactor, and in order to do that I'm going to need uranite. Also running low on Ruby, so.
all of Cthulhu. I love the Elder Gods type uh, stuff. I have never played in a Call of Cthulhu game, but I am fascinated by the lore of, uh, even though I don't like everything about Lovecraft, I am fascinated by the, the, the horror, cosmic horror mythos that he kind of created. Not even kind of. I just wish he was a little less uh, racist. Oh, I could imagine. Like, I... Yeah, I, I could absolutely see that. As I'm getting ready to depart, I see more, more urinite. And more ruby. Luckily, the people I've had run all have been fans. Yeah, did you see, um, there was an HBO series, it, only, it was a limited thing, it only ran one season, uh, called, um, Lovecraft Country? It was all about, like, Cthulhu-type stuff. Thoroughly enjoyed it. Yeah, it only lasted one season. Um, I don't know if you've seen, um... Loki or not. I mean, I figure you probably have. It was right in your alley. reason why I mention is because one of the actors that was in Loki is in Lovecraft Country and I don't want to spoil it uh, if you haven't seen Loki. He is definitely kind of a spoiler. I really, really would like a storage module. Just say it. Not because I want to treat the truck like a, uh,
like the Cyclops, because the truck is not the Cyclops. And I am 100% okay with it. But just because um, it would mean that I would have to make fewer trips back to base. Like I could, I could be prolonged, I could be out and about more. see how you can six okay oh it's a s I get it Doi. can't learn to read Hostile? Oh, you're, you don't really seem hostile. Uh, uh, well. Was unexpected. What are you doing? You can stop now. Oh, get me the fuck away from those things! Holy shit! I just wanted to scan you, dude. Kill. As they say, there are other fish in Oh, there's Hungry Boy. Shit. Uh. Just so angry. Yeah. I'm telling you, the moment I get the grappling hook, he's in deep shit. Oh, here he comes. Right now I am nickel blocked. I need nickel ore. I have not been able to find it. I 
I've been able to find other, pretty much everything else in reasonable quantity. I am going to get turned around somewhere, didn't I? Where's my base? Okay, let's get my personal inventory. Thank you. 
they really like to swim. Fight is bite me, stuck right behind me. Every man's murder is trying to mesmerize me. I guess they like me, and I can't blame them. I'm giving our vibes like radiation. Don't you forget about our radiation. All right. So it says here we've got two new beacons, but creep into these. Let's take a look at the map. I suppose I should go back to the uh, the Phi facility. I got ion batteries, so the truck is rocking like 2,000 power. Eventually I'll make a couple more and put them in the uh, prawn. But fine for now. Fine. Now we get to see some of the coolest jellyfish ever. The eyeball jellyfish. sleep till it's day. I'm going to pin a recipe quick. Hoping I can make that, and I don't think. It's oh God! Oh God! Well, I guess that answers the question I kind of had. No, it does not skim the water.
I still have because. Good. Yeah, if it had sunk, it'd be one thing entirely different, you know. Ah, shit. Did I just get turned? It has a boost, which is kind of temperamental. I don't know, I, I just... It, it feels drive thing. It's not nearly as responsive as I would expect it to be. So yeah, I'm starting the first uh, the first motorcycle club on Planet 4546B. I still need one. Dangerous weather approaching. Seek shelter. There's a penguin nest around.
interesting in here. Quartz, quartz. Surveillance activated. Until next mission. Well, no, little buddy, I need you to come back. Stealth mode activated. Companionship level, infiltration level. It's quartz. Ouch. <laughs> another spot ready for my assignment Dangerous weather approaching. Seek shelter. I was curious if they were going to do that. Hide, like, EDAs and stuff in these things. Apparently the answer is yes. Yes, they are. Well, power cell. New technology acquired. Snow Fox jump module. All right.
We also discovered this. Altera was digging up a, uh, a reaper. But not just a, like this thing is humongous. Like this is, honestly, this might be the biggest reaper I've seen in either game. And it's still infected with the alien virus. So. Requires injectable container to function. Really thought that that's what this thing was. But wow, indeed. Bullshit. Bullshit, I say. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what I'm. This, this place clearly serves a purpose because it's got that device there that says it requires an injectable container, but I thought that I had found the injectable container, and apparently not, so my working theory on that is now shot. Um, Dangerous weather approaching. Oh, Seek shut shelter. Up. Always dangerous weather approaching here. Alrighty, you have a good night, Brid. Thanks for stopping by. Absolutely got somewhere. No, I'm not gonna.
Dangerous weather approaching. Oh, my. Seek shelter. Ryan. systems online. Welcome aboard, Captain. Its only purpose is to heat me up. And there are probably easier ways, but this allows for expansion. Actually, it's time for me to call it a night. So I'd like to thank you all for watching. You guys have a great night. I will be back tomorrow night at night. Sub.